What's good guys, in this video we're going to be showing you one of the most important route combinations that you can have at your disposal in Madden 23. This is going to help you be able to beat the DB Fire 2 press, it's going to help you to be able to beat those cover 2 blitzes, and it comes to us out of the gun bunch. Now, um, the play is very simple, It's an almost, I'm pretty sure it's in every single gun bunch, but the play is verts. And I want to show you why. This play is going to be so important next year. So I'm just going to come out in really what I think a lot of people believe to be the meta blitz of Madden 23, which is going to be DB Fire 2. It's, it really is a very effective defense. And chances are you're probably going to see it ran on baseline like this. Now, um, what we're going to do with this is create a simple concept that I really like against Cover 2. And that is we're going to block our tight end. We're going to streak our slot receiver. We're going to drag Mike Evans, and then we're going to block our running back. So this is a max protect concept. And what I like to do is motion this receiver to the outside. And what you should see here is as long as I can get time in the pocket, he will get over the top of that soft squat, which is going to be very difficult to do um, in Madden 23. So what's going to force your opponent to do is go to some type of you know, cover two style of defense with a cloud flat. Now the same route combination is going to be able to beat this cloud flat. You'll see he is going to just get over the top, pass lead that to the outside. And as you can see, that is wide open against cover two defenses. Now another coverage that is going to be very good in Madden 23 is going to be man to man. And this is a great play against cover two man because of the fact that this wheel route, if they are shading underneath or if they're in a, a trail technique, a lot of times we'll get over the top and it will basically be like beating a cover two deep half over on that side of the field. Now where this can get a little tricky is with cover three and cover four. So if your opponent is running a lot of cover three and cover four, what's really good about this though, is the fact that the slot streak will do a really good job at kind of sucking the zones back and there's this little pocket right there where we can hit this. And again, in Madden 23, this is a little bit more of a tighter window against cover three and cover four, but it is still really good uh, for being able to beat cover two and man to man. And what this is going to do is it's going to force your opponent to have to understand that they can't just sit and cover two uh, blitzes all game. Now, let's say that you can actually block the blitz with your, um, let's say that you can block the blitz with your tight end. Uh, chances are you probably won't be able to in Madden 23. But if you can, you can put your running back on a check down, and then you can now have something to work with on this backside. Let's say you want to run a post, whatever whatever you want to do. But this, in my opinion, is one of the best routes to beat cover two every single year. And as you can see, if you read it wrong, you always have that as a simple check down. Thanks for watching the video. If you want to learn more about the Gun Bunch, you can get my entire Gun Bunch offensive ebook by joining our Patreon. It's only $10 to sign up. It'll also get you access to all of our Madden 22 content as well as any Madden 23 content that comes out while your Patreon membership is active. Thanks for watching the video. And again, if you want to get my Gun Bunch offensive ebook, the link is down in the description.